Hey everybody, Aza Grendel here, and we are back on the uh, Parents Guide world. Uh, I got GB with me. Are you over in Cheeseburg? Hello. Hello. You over in Cheeseburg? Yes, I am going to be doing some working. Okay, we'll come check on you in a little bit. Um, as you guys can see, there's a monstrosity behind me. This is a TNT duplicating tree farm, uh, which is semi-automatic. What it does is it... It, uh, it feeds saplings, which you can place while you're AFK, onto a certain spot, which causes, um, causes uh, bone meal to be fed onto them and grow up, and then it drops duplicated TNT down and explodes the tree, which gets caught into this water, flies down this waterfall, and then goes into dispensers. However... I built it, and I'm pretty sure I followed it by spec, uh, piece by piece, doing it exactly the way that I was told to, and um, it broke, and it blew up the farm, and it also blew up part of my creeper farm. So you can see I'm a little miffed about this right now, <laughs> and uh, we do want to have this. I actually do, I did film it. I still have the video. Um, I actually uploaded it before the farm broke and then as soon as the farm broke I got on YouTube and I deleted that video because I did not want anybody to accidentally blow up part of their base because I did not fully test something before I uh, put it out there so and I, I even did build this in my test world and it worked just fine uh, but for some reason I did something here that caused the um, yeah, I don't know. It caused the TNT dropper to become a TNT cannon. And uh, yeah, you can see the uh, you can see the problem that I'm having here. Not to mention this is a huge mob farm, which I'm going to fix. But um, this is all going to come down. Um, but what I was thinking is we need to have a better way of getting those basic materials that we get at the beginning of the game that we need in, ma in, in mass quantity in the, uh, in the later parts of the game for builds. So I'm looking currently for a good automatic tree farm, a good AFK tree farm, which is what I thought I had here. Um, I'm, I, don't build this. <laughs> don't build it until I can figure it out. Um, but, I did find a good stone slash cobblestone generator, um, which we also need. So we need to find a place in this area for it to go. And it has a relatively small footprint. You're looking at a one, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you're looking at a four by seven footprint for the um, stone slash cobblestone generator. Uh, so I'm thinking we'll build that one actually a little bit closer. Whee! Oh, also, I want to show you something. I got attacked by a, uh, a creeper while I was busy doing the lighting up of this area. Because you can see I'm just trying to make this a little bit nicer. Got a nice little walkway. Got a nice little wall going on here. The turtle's gone. I don't know where the turtle went. But, um... You might have just seen what I'm about to say, but uh, I got attacked by a creeper over here, and look what's gone. Our dragon egg. Our dragon egg is gone. But I was I was upset about that until I came over here to get a bucket of water for today's build, and I saw this. Our dragon egg has transferred under the water. <laughs> so there is a way to get that out. We're going to use... Um, very very simple trick I don't even need to get equipment I'll just steal this one right here um, but the way that this works is we are going to um, we are gonna get this here and I am going to replace this with a torch oh are you kidding me I don't even know how that worked how did that happen Okay, well, um, not really sure where my torch went, but let's go get another one, I guess. 
My torch got snuffed out, GB. I didn't really sure. Oh, there it is. It's on top of the water next to the sand. Anyway, what we're going to do is we're just going to knock out this sand and replace it with a torch. Hopefully we're fast. And now. And now. Got it. What the? It didn't want to do it. That is very strange. That is very strange. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just found a hidden ravine, GB. Ooh, ravines are good. Yeah. It goes right into your, uh, it goes right into your, your mine. Oh, the one at a, in the mine? I think I already know about that one. Yeah, did you know that it's... Maybe. It's filled with, like, the lava Ooh, this is better. Blocks. This is better. Huh? It's filled with magma... Oh, wait, no, I didn't know about that uh, one. The river opened up. Never mind. And I nearly one swallowed one me. one of my personal walls. Never mind. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I All have, right, um... A mine that leads straight to an underwater uh, ravine. Not really sure... Oh, you know what? We can put a fence post. I think a fence post. You can use a fence post to get a dragon egg too, right? Maybe. You can make it fall on the fence post? Maybe. Pretty sure you can. Anyway, I guess it's trial and error for everybody. So that's what we're doing today. Let's, uh, we only need one, I believe. I'm pretty sure that if the dragon egg falls on a, fr a fence post, it breaks. French post? A French post. You heard me. What the? Well, apparently, it did not care that it landed on a fence post. I'm getting very confused here. And I'm going to drown. Because I'm more occupied with this darn egg than I am by anything else. Okay, we should be able to put a... <laughs> oh, you know that one section of the village that I have left? What is going on? Did dragon egg mechanics change? Mm -hmm. It landed right on a torch, and it killed the torch. What What are you doing? I'm I'm getting frustrated over here. What are you doing? Maybe it has something to. Oh, because the torch probably broke since the egg is underwater. The torch broke before the egg landed mm -hmm. on it. But um, you know the one section that I have left in my village. What What Yeah. I just separated that one section into four sections to work on. So oh, okay, so you're making it, like a grid. Yeah, it feels smaller so that my brain and it feels like I'm doing less work. Oh, I understand. Even though I'm not. No, you know, I mean, what you're doing is you're sectioning it off and making it easier to work with. That's a good idea. That's a very, very good idea. Okay, we need some wood. We're just going to do this the old-fashioned way. I'm being lazy, and I'm trying to not do things the way you're supposed to and I'm forgetting how to make a piston there we go okay so let's piston this egg well you know what I'm on the lookout for a couple things one is a uh, a tree farm but I'm also trying to get oh no there's fish going down into the thing oh well guess you're down there now Anyway, what we're going to do is, I just scared the egg away. Where did I scare the egg to? GB! I didn't do it. I just scared the egg away. I didn't mean to. You didn't do anything. I did it. Wasn't a silk touch pickaxe to be able to take it? I, I don't know. I just accidentally hit it with my fortune pickaxe and it ran away. I wouldn't try it with your silk touch just in case you might destroy it completely because like I don't think I don't see how you destroy it completely. Yeah, but egg different. Hmm, that's true. Found it. Oh, where? Is it in the ravine? <laughs> Hiding in the ravine. I'm gonna call this the Easter egg hunt episode. Okay, so anyway, what you do is you go ahead and you plop that there, pop that there and pop. 
And there we go. We got our egg back. We got our egg back, and I'm... Wow, that was that was an adventure that didn't need to happen. But yeah, I got attacked by a creeper, and the darn thing blew up the egg, and the egg jumped into the river. So let's put the egg back on the pedestal where it belongs. Ta-da. It's actually kind of funny, because I have a torch down there. I got silk touch, hold on. I got a torch down here just in case. Boop. Yeah, see, you get the egg back. I guess I guess GB's right. I did it over the water, so it was just like, no, I don't want to go. All yeah, right. the torch got broken by the water before the. It's just some interesting timing. That's all. Torch. Just some interesting timing. All right. So, anyway, let's get rid of all this junk that's in my inventory now. After I had everything cleaned up, and this is all we really need for what we're building today. So let's uh, let's find a good location for it. I was actually thinking about right over here. Actually, you know what? We got that spot on the other side of the. Uh, We've got that spot right over here, which is not being used, that we've got the, um, yeah, yeah, this, this should be good. Let me see exactly how big this is. One, two, three, four, five, perfect. Okay, so we're going to put our, um, get out of here, I want eggs in my inventory. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put it right here, and the way that we're going to start off is we are going to have this and this out and first things first is we're going to make a little bit like a C shape uh, we're just gonna put down three blocks one two three and then we are going to put let's see six more going on the side here so one two three four five and six and then two more blocks just like this so we got this interesting little well not very interesting C shape uh, then we're going to put double chests like this lining this area and you just want five double chests the ref the uh, the design I found for this which was Mysticat, um, had four but like I don't know I've I'm next to the beacon and I'm gonna have haste on this thing when I'm working, so I don't want to accidentally destroy the back end of this thing and flood it or fill it with, with lava or anything. Um, on top of here, we are just going to put stairs. So we're going to put stairs right on here. So this is a, like I was saying, this is a slightly modified version. Then we're going to feed these five into here. And we are going to put this around here just like that so from the outside you've got this this little box this little box um, I am going to feed sorry I'm going to put a sign there and that is to stop the water flow from escaping you okay over there GB you sound a little stressed no that's that's Roman doing the oh it's, it's the puppy breathing okay. but um out of the four sections of my of my a last section, out of the four sections of my last section, I get to finish the section that had the town hall. Oh, very cool. So, we'll come. I finished the middle of the village. We'll we'll check it out as soon as we're done with this little tutorial here, okay? Yeah. So pretty much what I have next is the side with the uh, farm, the side with all of the houses, and the side with all the trees. Very cool. Very cool. And in the trees, there is the zombie. Okay. <laughs> so uh, next, all I did was I put uh, five buckets of water along these stairs. Then we are going to take another grouping of bricks. I chose these bricks just because I'm not using the blackstone very often and I like them. Um, but yeah, we're just going to go ahead and go around with that. Somehow I have one left over. It always makes me nervous when I have one left over. It makes me feel like I forgot something. But uh, I guess we'll just use it as a step right now. Um, then we are going to take a single block of lava and put it right there. 
which will turn that one and then start to slowly flow over the water, turning the water into regular stone. So now that that's up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and cap that off with this black stone. Tried to go for a little bit of a cool design. Uh, any non-flammable blocks will work. I'm going to go ahead also and put slabs on top so that we don't have any um, we don't have anything spawning on top. Now the way that I've got this is you can just walk up with any pickaxe and go here we go. See how it just kind of filled, fills itself in? Actually you know what I'm thinking this this last one might actually be completely useless. Ooh. So, the reason it is useless, and now that I'm seeing that, is because there is a block here and a block there, so I can't actually reach this last one. So, what I'm gonna do is just claim my hopper back. And I'm going to put this in there. And uh, I guess. Huh. Where'd that extra block go? You know what? I'll just use cobble for the time being. But, um. Yeah, we'll just do that. Put that there and. Eh, we'll use a stair. Why not? Doesn't look that bad. Fix it later. Anyway, you just come back here and you hit it. It'll fill itself back in. And then after a couple minutes, you're going to have all the cobblestone you want. However, if you come over here with a silk touch and you do the same thing, it's going to fill up with regular stone. Now also I have this near here for an important reason and that is not what I wanted. I did not want to fill up my inventory with eggs. Um, let us grab a uh, ooh, loaded there for a second. Let us grab a piece of iron. Iron. I'm going to grab two just because I'm going to reset it. Let's fly over here to our beautiful shining iron pyramid here. Let's go ahead and turn off. Let's put this here and I'm going to go like that. You can go haste. Oh, okay. Haste too. Okay. So now we have haste too. So I can take my silk touch pickaxe here or my fortune and just it's it's a lot faster than the lava even allows it to go but it's just gonna plow right through it and you see I've been actually doing this I, it was about half the time that I did before and look it's already it's already getting there it's already starting to fill up so this is going to be great because all you have to do is hit F3 T which will reload your debug screen but I'm not touching my mouse. I could walk away. And I could just let it go. And not have to worry about it. Yeah. I'm just going to keep filling, filling up, filling up, filling up, filling up. I can now, confirm that he is not touching his mouse. I'm not <laughs> his chair. Yeah, all you have to do is hit FT and 3. FT. F3 and T. And what it will do is it'll make it so that your mouse just continuously right clicks if you're holding down to uh, how, down on the right click button when you press those buttons. So there we are. We have now a wonderful, let me shake out of that. Let me shake out of that as I'm still stuck doing that. No, how do I do that? I'm a derp. I'm a derp, 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 I'm a derp. Okay, apparently press, pressing the, uh, you have to press the mouse again 
when you're done doing that. But as you can see, like, we already got all of this. We've only been doing this for a couple of seconds. Just to check it out, we have we have nearly two stacks of smooth of, of regular stone and half a stack of cobble. That's useful for me. I like using smooth stone. Come get it. Come get it. Not smooth stone, regular stone. Remember. Yeah, but that can be turned into smooth. That's stone. true. That's true. And that's another thing. Is if you hooked up a um, if you hook up an item sorter to this, which would make it significantly dip bigger. And had it so that maybe two of these actually led into furnaces. Instead, you could you could actually make this an auto smooth stone generator too. Ooh. Yeah, we could actually do that. We might consider doing that later. Um, but for right now, I think that is that is what we got for this. So let's let's go check out uh, GB's Cheeseburg project which I am super, super happy and impressed with because he's still sticking with it. Well, I can't just abandon them in their cheese pit. <laughs> in their cheese pit? Yeah, have you not seen it inside of them stone cheese? The fondue pit. Oh, you tore down the nether, or the, yeah, the nether portal. Yeah. Wow. I'm going to put it in a different place later. Wow. But there will be a village portal. Very cool. So Mayor McCheese over here, and I <laughs> put the sword down, sir. I've got one too. Oh, you're a mother. <laughs> so, um, Mayor, Mayor, uh, or yeah, Mayor Bread and I were talking about fighting the dragon again since uh, we we have the ability to create um, 18 <laughs> 18 uh, end crystals so we could we could resummon the dragon whenever we're ready are you going to tear those down or don't go after my chicken you going to leave the fences in there I'm going to level the floor then I'm going to make it all dirt later okay all right do your thing dude you know what you're doing. But um, over in... Oh, God, there's another stack of eggs in here. You want those in the pit? Yes, all chickens go in the pit, or the eggs go in the chest so that I can put them in the pit later. Okay. Well. I will have chicken farm later. Eat little chicken. Oh, I just ticked off your iron golem. What have you done? I threw eggs, and I hit him with them. You egged my golem. I did. But uh, as everybody, you next egg the town um, square. <laughs> if Is I need ready to. Yet? But uh, as you can see here, I have 18 gas tiers, 18. Um, do you have any glass? Um, what kind? Blocks. No. No. Okay. I'm gonna fly back over to site A, and I'm gonna put these things together because I don't know. Like, I know I played Minecraft for a long, long time before I even knew that you could create these things. Like, I don't... I'm sure that being able to make end crystals is uh, kind of new. I don't, I don't know if it's com if it's new, new. Well, like, not new, new. Not within the last few um, updates or anything like that. But um, I, like I said, I didn't know you could make them. And it's simple. It's so, so simple. You literally take um, ender pearls and blaze powder and create eyes of ender, which is the same thing that we use to find the, uh, the stronghold. And then you take those, and if you end crystal right here, it's just, you just take your end crystals, or you just take your... your um, your eye of ender and you put it in the middle you put the gas tier in the bottom and then there you go that's it that is it that's all you're doing so now we have a bunch of end crystals you need four of them to for my understanding you need four of them to summon the dragon um so we can summon the dragon uh what is that 
four times. Four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. We can summon the dragon four and a half times. Mm -hmm. Do you want to just fight half a dragon? Mm -hmm. What half? The left. <laughs> the left half. <laughs> We're going to bisect it. We're going to have to name it Eric. Disenchanted Eric the half a dragon. Please, someone name that. Someone has to know what that is. Hmm? I said, are we going to name the dragon Eric? Oh, you want someone to name their own? Yeah. It's not a dragon, not the original, but you know. But, um, anyway, so yeah, we got a, we got a, we got a cobblestone slash regular stone generator. I need a wood farm. If anybody knows of any good wood farms that um, that won't blow up my creepers. Because, oh my god, I got more eggs, 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 eggs everywhere. I don't want to continue chopping down trees like this, like manually. Because I've got all my trees planted out here. Oh, I have to do a video on my channel today. And this thing... This thing was doing so good. Like, so, so good. Look at this. Look at that. That's only like, that was like 10 minutes working. And then something happened. The tree got stuck. The The dynamite fell. And it TNT cannoned this way. And, and hit this. I mean, how am I? I don't even know how I'm supposed to fix it. How long have you been down here, man? Hold on. Wait a minute. There's a villager that had been trapped in one of the houses. Oh, that's interesting. You want to know something that I just found? What? So I was looking at the creeper. I'm, I'm at the creeper farm and I'm looking in the chest. Guess what's in the chest? What? Well, amidst all of the gunpowder, there's two pieces of leather and two uh, leads. <laughs> breathe, breathe. <laughs> So, I'm assuming a wandering trader led his llamas to their demise in my, uh, in my creeper farm here. That's not good, dude. That's not proper animal care. Ow. I hurt myself. I love this fountain that was created. I'm not even sure how that happened. He could be a fish person, Mr. Villager. Maybe he's a Lovecraft fan. Okay, now, now you're a... Oh I my gosh, dogs are barking. There's not even a barrel nearby. How were you a fish? I don't even know how this happened. Like, this is. Where are you now, butcher? This is ridiculous. I'm gonna have to clean this up. Come on, headband, Dan. Let's get buckets. I should have just got my buckets on me. Probably, I'm gonna need two buckets and. Yeah, you're a butcher now. Come on, butcher. Get in the hole. Let's switch to polished andesite. All right, well, I guess this is what I'm doing now. But, uh, but yes, I do need, I do need a good, um, I need a good, um, is there only one lava in there? Oh, there's only one lava in there. Um, I do need a good tree farm, if anybody happens to know of one. Um, that would be very, very nice. Four more sections. Oh my gosh, this place is trashed. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's something I'm going to be keeping my eye out for. Um, I need it. GB needs it. Because we're going to need wood for the builds that we're working on. I'm so just kind of embarrassed about this this tree farm fiasco and I'm really really glad that I was able to um, I'm really glad that I was able to find out that I screwed it up um, before anyone built this farm um, I don't know I mean even if the build is fine and I screwed it up, 
that would still, um, if anybody used mine as the tutorial, would screw up their stuff, and I don't, I don't want to see that happen. Especially if anybody decided they were going to build things like directly the same way I did, your area is either at that point filled with creepers or or just blown up, and that would be awful. Look at that, creeper farm's working already. Hey, buddy. How you doing? You need, you need, you need. Oh, God. <laughs> no. I broke it even more. No. Oh, I killed it. Are you in that tree? Maybe. Hi. I'm trying to fix this darn thing, and I, I broke it even more. What if I go and Nothing will happen because there's no creepers in there. <laughs> yeah, yes. You have to be a distance away from it for it to work. Really? That seems like the opposite for every other farm. No, if you're doing any kind of... Um, if you're doing a farm with mobs, you have to keep a di keep your distance. Why is there my gunpowder just put in my inventory? Because the... I'm in the chest of other gunpowder. Because it just blew up. Well, that's actually true. One of the chests blew up. I need to replace that. So, what should we call this episode? Easter egg hunting? Or boom. Creating a, uh... Building a stone farm. Or... Or... We can always call it blowing up your own base. I almost crashed right next to you. So I would have been the one who blew up. You already said in the beginning of the video that you were going to call Oh, God. Creepers, 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 creepers. Oh, this ain't good. Easter egg hunt with a bang. Ah, there's a baby zombie and a spider. I don't want to die like Filza. Egg hunt ends with a bang. Egg hunt ends with a bang? It's long, but it's good. Are you anywhere near a bed? Um, maybe I am a scarecrow right now. I need to go to sleep. Can can we go to sleep? Yeah. Let me know when you're in bed. Because yeah. there's mobs galore out. But, oh god, it's a... <laughs> well, what? thank you. What? Nothing, I've got an extra bed here. Kind of a brat, but I got fire extra. aspect. Yes, the bed is fire aspect. <laughs> In creative mode, you can enchant anything with anything. That's true. I couldn't be surprised. All right, so I want to get flint and steel and enchant it with fire aspect, and then go into survival mode. I don't think it'll do anything. Oh well, like I want to oh my gosh. Mode and then go into survival mode and just have that be like a thing. There's creepers all over the place because my creeper farm's tunnel is open. Oh, I crashed into one of your houses. The baby zombie is still down there. I landed in oh the chimney of the goodness. houses and I'm burning. Ah. I don't don't do that. I wonder what color this is. Ow. Red. Red. Okay. Baby zombie's gone. Now to handle the army of creepers that have decided to hang out. Oh god, there's another one hiding. Well, this is terrifying. How are you still alive? I am definitely not pranking you, but there's... in the case that I am... Don't worry about missing items because it is safe and you will be able to find it right after you end the possible prank that isn't happening. You're pranking me by I'm stealing not. something? I'm not. And I'm not stealing something. I'm looting something. Mm. I mean, I'm not looting something. I forgot so a hopper. I have to break something to move it and it and <sighs> is inside of the thing. Dude, today is not my day. Seriously, like I'm glad that I have like all the all the hoppers and stuff. I'm not worried about running out of hoppers. I'm just saying like today is just not 
not not my day. I actually recorded, uh, I uploaded, anyway, another episode of the um, Hardcore by the Hour, which is my frustration insomnia uh, show that I got going. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? You're flipping kidding me. So guess what else I forgot? Signs. No, I'm in the middle of a prank. I can't just not do that. Did you load out? Yeah, that's a... That hasn't happened in a while. Oh, you I got mean, kicked? I am plugged in. You got kicked? Yeah. Yeah, that hasn't happened in a while. Not since we uh, hardwired you. Yeah, and I am plugged in. Wee. That is interesting. Okay, there, there, and I do want to, I, I want to, done, I'm going to do this, alright, what I was trying to do is done, I'm going to make that bigger, and then fill buy this in with glass, what, what, did you say buy site B, yeah, I was leaving it, okay, I didn't, that I sounded don't definite, <laughs> I don't have TNT, don't worry. Anymore. Okay. Um. Where are you? Who? Mm. Me? Mm. I'm over by the creeper farm trying to clean up my mess. Wanna go to Site B for a Because I'm a derp. Okay, now the creepers are completely closed in. We can get up. There's two signs right there. Nothing's gonna accidentally fall in anymore. So. Oh, I accidentally fell in. <laughs> Hi. So we need um, we need a tree farm, like I was saying, uh, to get this. So I'm waiting for someone who's standing next to me, GB, Maybe. to tell me what's wrong with my my creeper farm now. Come on. What's wrong with it? I don't know, man. I'm eight. You're not eight. <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm eight. That was the best answer for a 14-year-old, uh, by the way. I don't know. I'm eight. No. You want to know what's wrong with it? What? Take a look. I'll get, give, you, give me three guesses. What is wrong with this creeper farm and why it's not going to work? It's on fire. Focus, the ki focus on the killing mechanism. There is none. There is none. Dude, can you get out of there? I don't know, maybe. Wait! I'm about to dump lava in there. You're going to have to get out. Thank you. Oh, yes! Okay. So that is back where it should be. There is the glass back where what it should I? be. What is this? Done. What is this structure? What? Where are you? I don't know. I can see you. I'm on this tree. Help! I found a structure. I don't know what it is. There's a minecart. That's the tree farm that broke. Do I not go in the minecart? Would that be dangerous? Probably. You're next to lava. Or, not lava. Oh. You're next to TNT. Oh, there's water. Alright, so what did you do to Site B? Uh, I did nothing to Site B. I did something in Site B. So you took something. Not it, really took. Moved would be a good word. Is it in the villagers' no. houses? No, it's, it's the... Did you, you took my donkey. No. Where's my donkey? I don't know. It's probably upstairs in your room. Did you put a donkey in my room? Maybe. Maybe I didn't. Maybe it's in the kitchen. There's <laughs> Where's the living room? You didn't, you didn't check the living Dude, room. Dude. Of course where? it would be my room. Wait, no, that's Laura's room now. Where? Where? It could be. You don't know. But what it did you do? Be living room or the kitchen i don't remember i see did the dragon try? head the dragon head's still there you didn't touch my stereo what, did you check the kitchen <laughs> <laughs> i 
Why is there a donkey in the house? Why isn't there a donkey in the house? <laughs> there is a donkey in the house. Why? Fly! Ow. Fly, donkey, fly. <laughs> oh, my leg. I broke my leg. Oh, my gosh, kid. Oh, I jumped off the roof. Taking donkeys in the houses. No! Fly! You're not going to catch me. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to take this thing out through the kitchen, aren't I? Oh my gosh, this place is Where not made for donkeys. Where am I now? GB, I cannot get this thing out of the house. Uh, uh, I had to break block to force it in. Did you? Yeah, I went through the kitchen, but then I had to break parts of the hallway. I can't, I can't get him out. I'm going to hurry at site A. We're right. Wait, no, there's B. No, that's a B. Wait, where am I? Where? What the? There's a wheat farm over here too. Yeah. I didn't know that. Dude, it's been there forever. <laughs> what is going on with you? You're like you forgot that we have a gold farm. <laughs> Do I need to take you to see the gold farm again? No, I'm good. I'll just show you. <laughs> That donkey has been on this world more, longer than you have. I've heard that a lot recently. What? Well, not recently, but I've heard that a lot. That the donkey's been in this world longer than you no, have? No, that something has been in this world longer than me. Yeah. Who tells you that? I'm hiding. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. Must hide. That's Please. fine. I have a fire aspect uh, flint and steel. I'm just going to burn down this house. What house? In Cheeseburg. No, I'm not even in Cheeseburg, though. Come out of hiding or your cheeseburgers get grilled. You don't know about... <laughs> I am near Site B. I'm not in Site B. I'm near it. Flame broiled cheeseburgers. <laughs> Uh-oh. I'm lost. You're lost? Yeah. All right. Well, it has been a very interesting time. You're close. You're close. I saw your name tag. Are you in the barn? Like, what, in the barn. what are you doing? <laughs> Suddenly, this has become a game of hide and seek. I am going to find GB. Um, so, let's see. Today, we had an Easter egg hunt. We, uh, we built a... We built a, uh, a stone farm, which does cobble and regular stone, depending on if you're using silk touch or not. And, and, we surveyed the damage that was the tree farm that should not be built. So, I'm going to go find this kid. But for as, uh, as for you guys, I uh, hope you have a great day. Uh, keep playing Minecraft, keep playing with your kids. And uh, try not to grow up to your, uh, too fast yourself. And I will see you next time in either this blocky world we call home or in our hardcore world that we now have. So, um, yeah, you guys just have a great day. See you later. Bye. GB, get anything? Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs> Bye.